Yeah, Danny, Paul Goldschmidt is your National League MVP. Came close a couple times before. Kind enough to join us via Zoom. Goldie, congratulations. What does this award mean to you? Thank you. I mean, it's awesome. Uh, obviously, to to win an award like this is is really special. And I think, to me, the the people that uh, I'm surrounded with, uh, starting with my family, my wife and kids, and my parents, and then you know all the teammates I had and coaches currently and and also in the past. Um, you know, I know it means a lot to them, and and they taught me so much, and I learned from so many guys. So I'm um, just really thankful for being surrounded by such great people and. Uh, to win this award. Your buddy, Nolan Arenado, was in the mix for the award, too. Did that add to it? <clears throat> I feel bad for him, man. He was the first guy to text me. He was the first guy I texted after the announcement. Uh, I don't win this award if, if he's not there, um, not just on the field, but off the field. That guy's one of my best friends. I talk to him every single day, <clears throat> vented to him, asked him for advice. Um, he made me such a better player. And so, I mean, I wish we both could have won this award, but um, I don't win without him. And uh, I want everyone to know that. And, and so thankful to get to have played with him for a couple of years and, you know, at least a couple more. And, you know, who knows after that? You're not a me guy, but I'm told you have some folks over. There may be some food. How are you going to handle all the attention? Because you are the National League MVP. Oh, we got a hot mic over here. Um, no, there's not too many people here. You know, it's just my family and a couple of close friends. Uh, you know, you never know how it's going to go. And, and you know, I'll enjoy this and I'll get to celebrate with my family over the Thanksgiving holiday and, and other friends at different times. But, uh, you know, it's just one of those nights. I'll, I'll enjoy it. And, you know, it's cool that, you know, my family got to be part of it and, and my kids and all that. And, you know, I've already maybe have almost 200 text messages. You know, I had my phone off, but turn it on. It's just been blowing up. So pretty special and just again thankful for all those people that have supported me and taught me and been with me and um, it doesn't happen without numerous people all the way back to I mean I'm thinking about little league coaches that taught me things and you know they probably don't even think I remember their name but um, I do and, and they impacted my life and my career and just so thankful for that team wise I know you guys didn't go as deep into the postseason as you would have liked but how much does that fuel you to get ready for the next season coming up Oh, yeah, that's the only thing on my mind. So obviously enjoy this tonight, but that's, you know, loss was extremely disappointing. Maybe, you know, the worst one I've had, you know, in the big leagues. I thought we had the team that was talented enough to win the whole thing. And, you know, I didn't play well in the playoffs and, and we lost two games and it was over. So, I mean, that's been on my mind every day as I go to work out. Didn't really take any time off and just get back in there and get ready for next year, talk to our coaches and our staff and find out ways that I can get better and we can get better as a club and just try to go into next year motivated. Um, and, and don't forget that feeling. I mean, that's what we talked about. Don't forget that feeling we felt after losing and use that as motivation and use it to help, you know, have some focus and, and be ready for next year. We really do appreciate you making time for us. Congratulations. Well-deserved. Thanks. Only for you guys. You guys are the best. Thank you. All right, Danny Mack, that's your National League MVP, Paul Goldschmidt.